Dog's life. <laughs> Come on, dog. Anyway, see you, mate. See you later. Come on, let's go. I must say, I'm really surprised that the creek doesn't have any water in it. Not that Rachel's really excited about me taking the dog for a swim in the creek, because she said, oh, his fur always gets matted. As can plainly see, the rain has not been enough to fill up the creek. Not a rain event. Very disappointed. You're supposed to be swimming here now, aren't you? This is where you do dog paddle. Would you like to walk along the creek, Gibbo? Yeah? Okay. Come on. Nice morning for a walk. Disappointed that we haven't seen more rain. But such is life. Such is life. All right, so the Joby tripod is an important part of my vlogging, filming setup. Because as I showed you guys last week, I went with a really compact setup. I went with the Canon M50s and I'm a minimalist. So I don't want a big DSLR. I don't want big heavy lenses. I want compact. This week is about sorting out the problem with the Joby tripod because nobody wants a Joby tripod that's falling over and breaking equipment. How I propose to fix this problem with the Joby tripod is replace it with an aluminium version, which is the pro version of the three kilo Joby tripod that I use. We're headed into the camera shop in the city to get the new 3K Pro Joby tripod because if I order it online, it's gonna take 10 days to get here at least. This here is one of my favorite little places to cut through in the city. Pretty little church. The only thing that this Joby tripod is good for now is handheld, and that's just no good. The beauty about buying stuff in the city from a shop rather than ordering it online is you get instant gratification. What a good business they've got. Apple, Google, and Amazon. They got it all figured out, haven't they? I can't wait to replace this crappy old plastic Joby tripod with the professional 3K version, the pro version with the aluminium ball joint. If you ever want to do a photo shoot in Brisbane City, tucked away just off Albert Street near the Queen Street Mall. Never too many people here, but nice background. The city is trying to return to normal, but not quite there yet. We have reached our destination, Digi Direct. These guys are gonna solve my Joby tripod problems. Just the lake, yeah? Yeah. You can't see the difference, but I'm now vlogging with the new aluminium Joby 3K Pro. So hopefully I won't have any more falling down tripod tragedies on this channel. So this was obviously going to happen to me walking into a camera shop, wasn't it? I found a tripod I want to buy, but they'll give me a nice discount for cash. Love you guys, heat. See ya. Sorry, photo ball. And I was going to shoot this little sequence about the Boost Juice. This guy came up and he wanted to know if we could buy him a juice. No, he wanted me to buy him a juice. Oh, he, wa he wanted Rachel to buy him a juice. So, probably walking around with all this camera equipment, we look a little bit too affluent. That's our good deed for the day. Seemed as though we were getting accosted by homeless people that wanted juices, wanted money. They weren't homeless. 
How come there's so many homeless they people? They were not homeless, I can tell Well, how come all these people... Are, why? How come there's so many beggars in the city? Is that just all what's happened after coronavirus? I think so. See, normally I wouldn't be able to leave this Joby tripod on the, on the roof of the car because it would fall down and destroy the camera, but now it's working and that's so good! There is only one thing that can possibly be done. There we go. Joby plastic gorilla pod burn Joby. Burn.